everyone, my name is Anna Mai and welcome to my channel. I am going to uh, alter some um, uh, puzzle pieces and I'm going to swap them. So I will try to um, make some and see how it will go and I will start with I will start with uh, this one this one is uh, gasoled and I am going to stamp and I think I will stamp with this stamp from Stamporticu and I will use Stay some. Thick clean color, real brush pen. It's a long word on this um, marker. Uh, this is pe peachcock blue. And light blue. And I like uh, to um, use to mix mix uh, more than uh, many colors with this I'm not uh, I don't like to use water because you can use water with them but I like most to uh, mix them together now you can see and I will mark around the edge with the touch black mar uh, marker. I'm not sure how well I will, but I will do in the puzzle, but I do the best I can. That's one, one, and the next one I uh, was thinking of. Uh, I will use this puzzle, and I have embossed some. Um, uh, I'm not sure. It's a tape, metal tape. Um, the worker. Uh, I don't know, but it's a tape, it's a metal tape, and I have embossed it with my big shoot. So I will just uh, make it into small pieces.
for a long time ago I made a many project with this metal tape so but it's a long time since I did this but that's what is great with this crafting there you can use old techniques or or paper or stems or it will come back so it's a bit a bit like um, alcohol ink uh, many people don't don't use it or they don't know what it is but suddenly it it's back again and popular so A little piece in the end. And I just will use I'm not, I don't think I have made or altered puzzle pieces before, so probably this is the first time. And I have this, I don't know what you call this uh, tool, but you can roll, roll it and you can get some nice pattern with this so I'm just I'm just take roll it a bit back so the metal tape flattened a bit so and now I just uh, use it around the edge just to make some pattern and if you have many small pieces and you have these sharp um, you can use this one to to uh, so you don't see all the where you have had many pieces together and then you can use uh, a tool like this just take it like that and I will get some paint. And now it's the it's really glossy, so so now I will use some um, black uh, paint. This one is oh, I don't want to go to use this. And I will paint with I'll paint I think I will paint the back and Probably I should paint the back later, but I'm not doing it now. And I take some black paint, and when I 
when I'm finished with that, I will I will take some paper and I will take off some of the black paint. Like so it's not that shiny. You can see here. Just a little bit like that. Then it had can dry a little bit. And then I will add the toilet paper. I probably will wash my fingers. I'm going to use this ink, acrylic artistic ink. Just take, yes, I have to have a I just take some drops. Oh, that was a bit too much, I think. Then I take just and you get the pattern. Then it had to dry a little bit and we can take um, on this one I was thinking of gluing onto this these I bought order from uh, China and I really like these and I have some um, bling I have uh, many different colors but today I will use this uh, blue tur turquoise so I will glue this on Bling. I hope this will glue. If if not, I think I oh, maybe I need super glue. But I'm not that. Uh, I don't like super glue. I got it in my eye one time, and I was so scared, and I had my eye opened. And I was scared that I I wouldn't uh, manage to open it again. So I know that was so oh, horrible. I think I will use sometimes I just need to use then it had to dry. And on this one we're going to stamp and I need a black stay on and, and I was thinking of using this flower and I now I'm just um, stamping just to make a um, uh, what, what? Um, 
not sure what I'm doing. Yes, I'm. Now I'm just using this um, flower just to make some uh, pattern. So it's not, you don't need to be precise or I just use it. And I think I have to try a little bit. And I can, on this one, I I was thinking of making them to, to um, charms and yeah, I am not sure right now, but uh, I will take a glossy accent on this one. And, oh, I think I will use a white, white mark. Oh, yeah. Then I can use A bottle like this, um, you can have it a long time. Maybe it seems that you, when you're using glo um, glossy accent, that it's expensive. And but the bottle you can, I have had the bottle a very long time, and I have uh, done many small projects, and but I like the shiny or the glossy. And if you get the bubbles, you can use a, I'll use a head, no, I don't know what you call this. And then the, this one has just dry. And we will mark around this edge. I think that um, I'm not used to this camera, uh, this angle of this camera, so I'm trying not to uh, try that you can see what I'm doing. So, but f I think I will learn this. And I was thinking of using, I have some stickers, I had, I'm gonna use this one, and i probably take on the top. Um, bit I just take two on that I have this um, these um, butterflies or 
it's not butterflies, but um, I'm not a uh, bee, a little bee I made from a dye, from a dye, and and then I have used glossy accent and pattern paper, and so I will glue this onto like that. Um, but I take glossy accent because I will fill glossy accent in between after so probably like this and I'm just trying to find the color and I'm not sure I can I can use this they are pearl marker and I will take in between the stickers in the small like that and then it has to dry Take glossy accent on this. Of course, it's going to be. Oh, I should have a little. Of course, I didn't have that here. Finished. It has to dry. I'm not sure. Maybe I will destroy this. I will take glossy accent on this when it's dry. And I am going to. Um, you can see how they look when they are finished. And I will have glossy accent on this one also. So, what I was thinking of doing... I will use, um, I have some that are, you can see here, I have some that are a bit smaller and I probably will use them or if not I will use one of these. What I do I can show you on, I can take this piece and I will glue it like this. Or I can glue it in, but I think these on the puzzle are 
great for using. So, and then I can have uh, some jump rings or or um, other things, so I can uh, can hang them on. They could be charms, and also I have some. Uh, what do you call it? Magnet, magnet, magnet. So I can take them onto the refrigerator, fridge, fridge, or fr no, I'm not sure what you call it, but um, you can have them on uh, anything really. So I think I am finished, but I will, um, I will see if I will come back and uh, show you the next process but um, but it's just to glue these these small uh, I don't know what they call oh I forgot I have forgotten it so but uh, if anyone wants to know it just uh, write and uh, in under my comment comment on oh my god comment uh, in the um, video or pay me and or whatever i will i will tell you what i call so what the name is okay then i will um, let these try and thanks for watching and hope to see you again have a great day night evening and now it's late in Norway, so okay, bye bye.